Our population is living longer, with ever more of us becoming overweight or obese through poor diet and lack of exercise. If left unchecked, that could lead to serious long-term health problems, or worse. The NHS Health Check is available every five years for everyone from 40 to 74. To identify early signs of medical conditions or lifestyle choices that could lead to serious problems in later life, they're free of charge and look for silent, symptomless risk factors for heart disease, stroke and kidney disease, as well as early signs of diabetes. If you're over 65, you'll also get advice on the signs and symptoms of dementia to look out for. At the reception from the local doctors called me and said, do you want to come through for an MOT check? You know, you're at that sort of age now where we like to have a, a look and check. My trigger for the health check was obviously, you know, I'm, I'm not getting any younger. I just wanted to know where my health was at at this moment in time. It's usually done by a nurse or healthcare assistant who will ask you some simple questions about your diet, lifestyle and family history. They'll also measure your height, your weight, your blood pressure and do a simple blood test. It's just a really simple check. It wasn't onerous in any way, it was, it was not traumatic. It's made to be as less invasive as possible. The only part of it that was slightly painful was for a split second and that's the pinprick for the blood test. NHS health checks are carried out at GP surgeries, pharmacies, workplaces, sports clubs, shopping centres and council offices. We're not here to lecture, we're here to help. Help support you with personalised advice that can help keep you healthy and allow you to get on with your busy lives. They gave me advice on increasing my exercise, eating a lower fat diet and things like that. It was just how I could increase activity throughout the day. NHS health checks have delivered results, identifying people at high risk. One in 27 people have been found to have high blood pressure, which is a risk factor for heart attack and stroke. One in 110 has been found to have type 2 diabetes that they didn't know they had. And one in 265 has been found to have kidney disease. Waiting till you have a heart attack before discovering that your arteries have been narrowing for years is a bit like waiting till you've had a car crash 